Let's blow some stuff up! Yeah, hello everyone and welcome to another random gameplay video. It is a Hudson game. And I believe it is Bomberman Generation! Yeah, obviously, because I put the game in. Infinitely expanding <laughs> universe. Uh, this is where energy unfathomable... And bombs, lots of bombs. ...to humankind is overflowing. With bombs, gotta have the bombs. In the search for this unknown energy... Explody bombs. Many researchers have challenged outer space. That sounds a little dangerous because it could explode. The time is cosmic year 2000X. Dun dun dun. Oh. It is a bomb ship. The bomb research lab <laughs> by Professor I has succeeded in mining bomb elements with this secret energy. Awesome. For the peaceful utilization of this strange power. A space freighter carrying bomb elements made up of six crystals. Something like this. Has departed. Should not fall bomber. into evil hands. However. Ah, oh, poop. Of course there's gotta be something wrong. I mean, of I mean, this is a game after all. Bandits, <laughs> for domination. Yes, that's actually their name. <laughs> No. And so the great battle for the bomb elements begins. All right, let's go get back those bomb elements. Well, when we get to the title screen, that that works pretty well. <laughs> Woo! Hyperspace. Yeah, explosions. Cell shaded graphics. I will press start and play a normal game. Yeah, that's fine. Brand new, please. That sounds good, my pommy cursor. He's just polishing the bombs. He really cares about the most perfect explosion possible. <laughs> I wonder if he polishes the pieces of the bomb after it explodes. <laughs> you may have already heard. The space and like glues them back together or something like that, I don't know. <laughs> How does he see through those glasses? Has been attacked by an unknown entity and destroyed. We've seen that in the intro. It appears the six bomb elements loaded on the freighter have been pulled in by the gravity of nearby planet Tentacle. Oh, poopers. Thereby scattering them all over the planet. Gonna have to get those back then. We have received information that our evil foe, the Hickey Hickey... But first, I gotta finish polishing my bombs. <laughs> ...are making large-scale moves towards planet tentacles. It is clear that oh man, they look vicious. Are involved in the attack of the freighter. Never before have I seen if even one bomb such an evil-looking group. Hands, then space will be as the Hickey Hickey bandits, please. That would be a terrible thing. Indeed it would. Here is the plan, Bomber Man. We will be dominated by synchronized dancing. You must retrieve all six bomb elements before they do. Yeah, I figured that. Uh, we have also uh -oh. received more troubling news. The Higgy Higgy bandits are headed for Planet Tentacles with our rival, the Crush Bombers. Oh, that's not good. I'm sure you already know to keep your guard up, Bomber Man. Recognize any of them? You may no, you mean not, not have seen my Bomberman walkthroughs. <laughs> but just to be on the safe side, I'll send Max, who's here right now. I'm gonna do it my way. Who are you, Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> All right, we don't have time to waste. The I answered to no one. To he said that like luck, fifty times in Shad the game Shadow the Hedgehog. All right, finally after our, after like five minutes, here we are. <laughs> Tentasia Octopi Woods. It's time to battle the very tentacles themselves, and 
Um, hopefully they aren't painful when going in. Oh wait, never mind. It's, 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 shouldn't make those kinds of references. <laughs> Alright, so we can drop bombs like so by simply pressing the A button and they'll eventually explode. You can also pick them up by pressing the A button while they're on top of that thing. You can also kick them into stuff. Yeah! And that's gonna get out of the way, isn't it? Because my blast radius is terrible! <laughs> oh, jeez, this is... My... <laughs> It has to be like right next to an enemy in order to blast it because I've only got one firepower. See that at the at the bottom left corner there? <laughs> Give me firepower! I demand firepower or at least more bombs. Well, oh, the speed up, that's kinda nice. That still doesn't give me bombs. Oh, there's a bomb. And yeah, you can knock stuff like trees over. I don't think you can you can blast these trees. Nah, I didn't think so. Just I would try that. Hmm, we got a tutorial here. Gotta lift up a bomb. Just You just gotta pick it up and hold it. And what'll happen is it'll charge up and turn into a larger bomb. And now you can break stuff like this. And good thing I have two bombs so I can multitask. Yeah. Sometimes there's stuff uh, like that and... Yeah, I mean, you can stop, find stuff on their boulders and stuff. It's an exploration game to an extent. If you're just going to the end of the stage, you're gonna miss quite a few things. Uh, music. Tropical. Yet innocent. Yet fun. I, don't, I have no idea what I'm trying to say here. Alright, I got little blast radius. I will take you both out. Somehow. If I manage to stun you long enough for the blast to hit you, there we go. And take down that tree. The trees hurt me? I don't think so. Yeah, I didn't think so. <laughs> just thought I would try that for the fun of it. Just, uh, I, I always remember when I first played through this, I would avoid the trees falling over, and I didn't think they would fall and hurt you because they're kind of an unexpected thing. Like, you don't know which direction they're going to fall. So I don't, I think that would be kind of cheap if they were to fall. At, on you, and you know, you take hits from that. You know, you can make a bridge here using that tree. Yeah, there's stuff like that in the game as well. So it's got some mini puzzles along the way. It's it's definitely the first level of the game, so it's not going to be very difficult to figure out stuff like this. Especially since they kind of give you mini tutorials along the way by, um, like they put a pot next to a tree so that you would blast the tree. And then what would happen is you'd notice the tree fall, and you knew you'd be like, Oh, those kinds of trees fall! Use the big bomb. I will use a big bomb. Yeah, yeah. you can't see that off-camera, but... Or maybe, I mean, maybe I can't see it off the side of the screen, but you can. That tree there, you just gotta kind of aim the bomb towards that suspicious spot there. And we've got a Higgy Higgy bandit here with a hula skirt. Yeah, they are some of the silliest enemies in Bomberman history. And I'm going to have a lot of trouble killing you, aren't I? <laughs> How about a nice big blast? This should take care of you. Yeah! I should have been using that from the beginning, in all honesty. Ah. <laughs> nope, I got it. Couldn't tell off camera. As I said before, the I'm using a uh, older CRT screen to play games, so I can't see the edges of the screen. So you actually have more vision of the screen than I do. So you have the advantage here, viewers. Uh, which path should I take here? Because there's this. I mean, there's there's a bunch of these uh, like warp pipes. I know they're not warp pipes, but they're they're kind of like that. They are they're warp stumps. <laughs> What's inside? Still no increase to in my blast radius. Seriously, I am I am befuddled by this. <laughs> is there anything in these things? Because all you need to do is upgrade it to two. Two there we go. Two is much, much better than one. Just watch. That is even though it doesn't look all that much bigger, it is a, a very, very big advantage compared to a one blast radius. Remember, you don't you don't necessarily have all the time in the world to charge up a bomb every time you need to defeat an enemy, so yeah. It's kind of uh, uh, handy to upgrade your stuff as you go. 
Oh, it still missed. <laughs> well, it's certainly better. <laughs> well, that one got him. Somehow. Got really lucky. Now explode! I wish I had a remote control. <laughs> you know how great remote controls are in Bomberman games if you play them. I'll make that bridge now. While I can, just for the fun of it. Yay! Oh, I guess it's not a bridge. It's to cut off the water source so I can go in it. But what I'm gonna do is go inside the... Oh, that's an exit stump. Though, yeah, you can't go through them, but you can come through them. You get kind of pooped out there. Eh, okay, nothing there. Hmm. Yeah, you can't. You don't. You can't jump out of these things. By the way, you, in Bomberman games, you typically cannot jump. And whoops, I didn't mean to. Well, I guess I kind of have to do this because <laughs> I need something from here. Actually, it's a fish. Oh, it's so cute. But it's out of water. How does it live? These are car bombs and. You can collect these things all throughout the game, and they have different sorts of abilities, and they can even battle in certain things later on. So... Oh, saving, thank you. <laughs> I would like to show the critter, if you don't mind. Oops. I forgot... The, oh, there we go. It's the uh, X button, excuse me. So then you... Wait, can you hold what to... Ah, what? C-stick? Oh, okay. What, what? I guess I wasn't paying attention to the controls at all. <laughs> so, yeah, as you uh, have it up as your critter there, you can power it up with uh, food. Thanks for the interruption. That's what I was just gonna explain. <laughs> Whatever one is equipped will uh, level up as you collect the feed. So let's collect some feed, shall we? Yeah! That's for attack. Special. Oh, that, that's what was for attack, that was for defense, that's special, and I couldn't see what that one was. <laughs> Those are all for different abilities, and I can't go back. Oh, poopers. <laughs> I, I feel I missed something off to the bottom left there, but eh. This is a random gameplay after all, I'm gonna miss those holes, aren't I? I am terrible at putting. <laughs> oh, what the heck? That one just went in. I mean, it, it blocked my shot. Go in. Get in. <laughs> I, guess I, can't, I guess I can't be too close to it. In order for me to do, to do my shots. I, I thought it was just blocking me from plopping a bomb, like pooping a bomb on top of the hole, but I guess not. But yeah, those flowers contain goodies. And I forgot, where can I see the abilities of Caribou? Ah, oh, there we go, it's a Z button. Aha! And you get, when this is equipped, a greater height and distance of throwing bombs. So let's try that out, actually. Yeah. So that's what it looks like, and if I throw it, I mean, if I don't hold the control stick, he just throws it, like, straight up. See that? And if I hold it forward, it throws far. So it gives you control over the trajectory of it. And where am I now? Uh, was that where I came from? Yes, I think that was where I came from. Because this is the thing I missed. Oh, okay, now it's popping me up. Ah! <laughs> Luckily, I've got a lot of health. This game is pretty easy overall, actually, so... You won't find yourself dying all that much. I'm very happy to have three in firepower now. <laughs> Just look how much of a, a difference that made just on those other two. Uh, which one? I guess this one. <laughs> that is not where I want it to go. Guess I gotta uncork that if I want to go through. Uh-oh. We got an Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl alert. I can knock it out of the air with uh, a bomb. So, come over here. Yeah! <laughs> Bloop. They can uh, dive bomb and attack you, obviously. There's this little plateau if you want to attack it from there, like if you don't have that uh, Carabomb, but eh. Um, I can't go through there, right? Yeah. Do I need to send the bomb on that? I forgot what I need to do there. <laughs> Am I really supposed to ride? Or just... Can I get... Across over the bridge. Thank you. I guess I can get across there. I thought I needed to do something upriver, but I guess not. 
And if I uh, follow it, yeah, I'm doomed. <laughs> oh, another Kara Bomb. I w Stop interrupting me! <laughs> I will. By the way, these stages are also pretty long, as you can tell, so I'll probably only do one stage here. Yes, I will use an explanation here, because I haven't played this in a while. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay, yeah, bomb jump is like a bungee jump. So, gotta aim for the log. Here we go. Wait for a log. Actually, maybe I should just go now. Mm, yeah, that worked out. Not that hard. And it wasn't very much of a bungee now, was it? <laughs> And I can now make water bombs! Woo! Now why would I want to do that? Well, bombs with different attributes can do different things. Like the water bombs here can burn... Uh, burn fire. It can... Bah! What am I trying to say here? <laughs> it can put out fire. There we go. Uh, let's see here... Bomb select. Merge with the fire bomb and the aqua bomb will be created. Can I like? How, how do I? Ah, I'm forgetting so many things. Hmm. 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 Like how? What? A A B Z slot, right? A B. Z, all at once. <laughs> I forgot how you merge that. Like, maybe do I have to select... Because if I, yeah, if I press the A button, that, that happens. Z button is the same. I'm supposed to move it over? I'm not using the water bomb, I know that. C-stick, D-pad, anything. <laughs> I'm clearly forgetting how this works. So you know what, I'm out of here. <laughs> Oops, I forgot to put that guy back up there. My bad. <laughs> this is what I get when I make a random gameplay without improvisation. Anyway, down here, I mean, without uh, checking ahead, what you can do is un... Oops, I didn't wait long enough. Uncork the boulder and run otherwise you'll be washed down river or downstream but why couldn't I equip the thing that's <laughs> and you see my save file I've played through this game before <laughs> so it's just simply me forgetting how to combine stuff basically and I'm not really paying much attention to the directions now am I did I kill him? I didn't kill him. Because I didn't hear the cries of despair. Alright, wait. Just one more time here. Let's just... Hmm. <laughs> huh. I feel I'm missing something here. <laughs> like I'm, I'm missing something glaringly obvious. Even though I pressed every single button on the controller. Wow, that's got a large blast radius. Yeah, you gotta always look out for your blast as well, because your own bombs can hurt you. Like other games, sometimes your own bombs don't hurt you, this one does. But, well, in all Bomberman games, it always seems like your blasts hurt you. But I mean, in other game franchises, so... If you play a Bomberman game, it is a chance that you can get hit. I mean, if you play other games, you don't know if your bombs are going to hurt you or not, unless you try it. <laughs> that is just embarrassing that I was not paying attention to how to do the water bomb combination thing. <laughs> I'd like to kind of show that. Unless maybe I can't do it now? I'm... Ah, there we go. <laughs> I got a heart! Uh, that's the boss, so I'm gonna go up this way. Oh. 
I can't do this, can I? Wah! Can I do this now? I don't think I can do this now. Maybe I need the water bombs! <laughs> no, I don't think... Because, yeah, that, that's what happens if I go next to it. Mm. Well, it's boss time. Uh-oh, it's a flower fan! What will I do against its gustiness? And it really does push you back with its gustiness. Uh, what you want to do here is time your bomb kick so that your bomb explodes as it goes near it. If you can, because otherwise it'll actually blow your bomb back at you. It's not a hard boss, you just gotta time your stuff. Gotta fight the wind. Gotta fight the power. Yeah, no. Oh, must last. Throw any stuff. No, get back. Over. Eh, maybe I should be using this. <laughs> Come on. Wah. Yo, you can't blow that back. Oh. My memory. It is never good. It is never my friend. Oh, I wasn't holding them. <laughs> the control stick forward enough, long enough. There we go. Don't blow it back, please. There we go. You just gotta get it behind the thorns in order for him not to blow it back. There we go. Voila. Yay. That was slightly embarrassing, but I still made it. <laughs> Area clear. Next time, I will pay more attention. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the video here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. I figured it out! You need to find one of these things. It's a bomb merge portal. And then you can merge your bomb! So I wasn't doing anything wrong. It's just that I totally forgot about this step. And it was in the next stage. It's like halfway through the next stage. Yes, please. Merge. Go! I want to show the water bombs. Yay! And now, I can select water bombs. Well, aqua bombs. <laughs> Erase, it's more like putting out flames. All right. So, now you can do this two ways. You can either select it with the C stick, like so, or go into the bomb select. Voila. And now it's selectable. So, oh geez, <laughs> yeah, so it's like a bluish explosion of sorts, maybe it's an explosion of water with very sharp water blades or something like that that cuts up stuff, cuts up plants and turns them into a salad and here's what you can do, yeah, fantastic, and now the video's over because I figured it out, <laughs> hope you enjoyed, see you later.